are back with another video, guys. And today, I am going to be showing you guys how to make a DIY plastic fish trap for like anything you want to put in it. If you want to put it in a pond, a stream, whatever, it's going to work. Trust me, it definitely will for some little tiny fish. So let's get right into it. Next step, guys. So have the plastic bottle. Have this. I can see some people use this as a lizard trap, but put it in just like that. Press it down and it fits. And then you just put some tape on it, just like this, with some fishing line. So you can pull it back up out of the water once you're ready. Because you do not want to go searching for this thing. <laughs> Trust me on that one. So yeah, just do this and I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna use as bait. Ready guys, so we have all the plastic fish traps right here. And I'm gonna sit right there. But we're gonna go to the creek later on, guys. I have a few stuff to do today. So I'm gonna go over there really, really quick. And it's so hot out here in Georgia. It's about 90 degrees outside right now, guys. So I'm gonna run these fish traps straight over to the creek. And then I'm gonna record that, obviously. But after that, I'm gonna leave it for 24 hours and have to go back there tomorrow and pick them up. So I'll see you guys then. All right, you guys. So. This is a little stream I like to come to. It's kind of like a little creek, stream, you name it. That's what it is. But the water is actually getting lower and lower each time I come here. There's a lot of big fish over here in this little canal. So we can head up here. Let's see. It's out because it is in the middle of the day, it's the afternoon. So let me see. Ooh, it's out. Yeah, one, two little big fish. Right there. I can see them. Step one. But yeah. Go over here. This is actually where it's happening to a lot. Okay, there's a lot of fish over here. This is actually where the fish live. There's a bunch of fish right here. So we're gonna put one of the traps right here. Wow, that's one of my nets. I left it here. Oh, I'm always leaving stuff, but. Yeah. See what's over here as well. It might be a same big snapping turtle. But we're behind let's see. Looks like some big fish over there. And yeah, that's pretty much it guys. We're gonna set these trip these traps. Put one over here. And I don't know where we're gonna put the other one at, but I have four of them. I'm gonna kinda put them out everywhere. So I'll get back to you guys when I'm putting them down. Alrighty guys, now that all of our beautiful bait traps are in the water, I have some more bread. Another piece. We're just gonna chum all around it. You can see the fish already over there, checking it out. They were, it was a lot over here actually guys, but they are man. So just wanna get enough, just enough chum in there. Just where I was like, oh, there's bait over here, there's food. We can go inside that, get some more food, and it'll just encourage them to go in. So I will see you guys tomorrow, tomorrow morning around four, well tomorrow in the afternoon around four o'clock guys, to see what we caught in our new fish traps. So I'll see you guys then. Guys, so today it is the next day guys, and I'm gonna be heading over to the stream right now, but right now I'm at my house. As you can see, all my setup is over there guys. But I'm really thinking about moving my animals inside, you guys, because I don't know. It's just so hard keeping them out here in Georgia because I live in Georgia. So it would be different if I lived in like Miami, Florida, where you can keep your animals outside. But over the winter time, I definitely got to bring them in. So why not bring them in now? And I can make so much more content for you guys with my fish and all of that. So, yeah, I'm just going to let you guys know on that. But I will see you guys at the stream. So let's go. Alrighty guys, so we are here with our crayfish. I'm not really sure where should I put them. I can put them into my monster fish tank with my new baby Oscar, but there's a problem because my Oscar, they can all gang up on him and decide to eat them. Or I can put them in here with my turtles. I can't guarantee it to you that they'll stay alive. Because my turtles, she loves to eat anything bugs everything that falls in and she is now coming up to me as well my red slider 
slipper. So, I mean, I don't really know where to put it, guys. So, I can definitely fill this up today and possibly put them in here, but I don't have any uh, water that is ready for these guys. So, I don't know. You guys let me know. And you see, they punctured a hole into the back already. So, it was leaking all of my bag. So, that's why it's less water. Shoot. But, I'm gonna find a home where to put these guys. And I'll be right back to you guys. All right, guys. So, here we have this. <laughs> Look at this one. He's stuck at the top. Yeah, buddy. All right. Just pop it open. Just like this. And then, this is the actually different water. Use this different water from outside in my aquarium. So, cut number one. Took the rest of it. Okay, then, he just paste the bag. Man, please let go. Let go. And crayfish, they grow so quickly. I remember at my other house, you guys, my crayfish grew so fast, but this one has a little bit of red and blue on it. So we're gonna put them all in right now. All right, so here's the big moment. Thumbnail. Well, right there. And then we can put him. First one. See, then you can kind of see it right there. And now it's time for her brother and sisters. But this water is actually outside. That's This is my monster fish aquarium water. So we'll just dump these guys all in. And that's where they They're all in. You can see them right there. He's heading towards the browser. This is the browser meeting for the first time. <laughs> what we trying to do? Oh, the browser eating? This just turned into a battle, guys. Look. Probably just... Probably just snapped at him. Oh my gosh. His friend is running. Look at Bowser. <laughs> this is hilarious. All right, Bowser. We don't want you fighting any guests. Sit Bowser over there for now. Let these guys get comfortable. This is a big one. So, you be careful. The Bowser will eat you. So I will go hide if I'm here. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. And I'll see you guys outside for the outro. All right, guys, so I hope you absolutely enjoyed today's video. Guys, I will be posting every single day for about a year. That's my goal, because I want to have a lot of videos. I only have 10 videos on my channel right now. So I just want to post a whole bunch of videos and I'm kind of running out of ideas. So show, tell me in the comments down below what you guys want to see next because i would definitely go and do it <laughs> like fish trap videos fishing videos and different animals i can get for you guys because i have actually two more spare cages they're really really big and i can put them in my room soon wow my home is getting sore holding this camera but i can put them inside really really soon they're actually right there so they're just black cages i can try and i don't know what i'm gonna do but with those cages yet. But guys, just absolutely destroy that like button, subscribe to my channel, and then it'll give me money so I can do these YouTube videos and give you guys even better content than now. So I will see you guys on the next one of this channel. So peace.